Welcome back everyone to Hearts of Iron 4, in which we are playing as or with the Gross Deutscher Bund mod. I'm your host, Herr Mokalova. And right now we have the invasion of Portugal. Today, Spain and France carried out a surprise attack against a neutral Portugal, claiming a restoration of the Iberian Union. While Spain or Spanish troops are advancing towards Lisbon, uh, the French fleet started a blockade of the harbors and into Portuguese colonial holdings, and now Portugal looks really, really bad. Holy cow, that looks god awful. We issue a protest note. We are running out of fuel. As we're trying, I'm, I'm literally trying to make a bigger army here, just because when we do go to war with the common turn, which is not good. Um, hopefully we have enough soldiers to, for all the fronts, especially like the finish one, maybe. Well, oh, that's not looking too good, now, is it? But anyways, seeing the invasion of the former ally, the British have started to seize the French holdings in India, as as well as sending troops to protect Portuguese Mozambique and Timor. Britain finally does something. Peace in our time. Oh wow. That is interesting, to say the least. All right, well, everything is escalating. And am I talking about real life, or am I talking about the game? Hmm, I don't know. Actually, I might, but whatever. Doesn't matter. Doesn't, doesn't matter right now. And we get, hmm. If you'd like to read about this, go right ahead. Born 1892, developed the second as a seventh child and only girl. She was a favorite of the late Kaiser. Oh God, seventh kid? Man, those are some rookie numbers. We've got to pump those numbers up. She could become a field marshal. Now, I've got a lot of comms to go through here, but uh, this is basically one of them. We should have Princess Victoria Louise of Prussia as a field marshal. That doesn't make a lot of sense to me, but we'll do it anyways. Ah, oh, yes. Sorry, I'm a little excited for that. Hmm. Anyways, we're building some refineries. We're building some more refineries. We're building some civilian factories. Not many military factors, which could, honestly could use more of. We could use a little bit, slightly more tungsten, which you know what, at this point, Portugal's looking pretty weak. They could use a little bit of help. We have building projects finished up, which is nice. And so here's my plan. Uh, so there was a comment from me saying I should do naval rearmament, and I really should. Uh, I do want to go down these these paths fairly quickly, um, just because... Ooh, get more factories that way. But I, I'm going to go down the path as far as we can until war actually breaks out. So, as someone did say in the comments, we should do some naval rearmament, which we will. The Anglo-German naval agreement we secured in 1935 allows us to expand our navy greatly. We should spare no effort in doing so. Cool. And we're about out of fuel. Which sucks. That's alright. Because we need more air and naval XP, and Portugal surrenders. After the surrender of Portugal, Spain started to place garrisons in all major cities and on the Portuguese islands. Most of the Portuguese lead already fled to Brazil by the time, luckily. A tragic but unsurprising ending. Oh boy. Oh wow. They actually changed color to a pukey green. Wow, why would you want to do that? Uh, what is this? Popular front. Wow. Engineering advances. Uh, they still have the uh, La Resistance DLC, right? Spanish focus tree was La Resistance, so. Hopefully we can do okay. I hope we do okay here. And Spain seizes Gibraltar. Wow. That is gutsy. French ships started the bombardment of Gibraltar this morning, cutting the strait, the strait off. Effectively removing the English control over the rock while Spanish troops started si sieging it from land. The operation must have been planned for a very long time, given its astonishing success. That's to make Britain furious. Well, at least there's... That is one hell of a thick Bulgaria. Look at that big boy. Oh, I, I said this last time too, but that's just beautiful. So, oh my goodness. So we have these guys over here. I kind of want to train you all just in case. Field Marshal Friedrich Schutz. Looking all right. I hope we can hold, like... Oh, the French are bearing colonial treaty. After the joint attack on Portugal, both powers would agree to withdraw the colonial borders in exchange for colonies in the northwest Africa. France will be allowed to keep all sub-Saharan holdings of, Portugal, of Portugal and Spain. Why can't they just call it the Great Sand Exchange? That's actually a good point. Now that... Uh, uh, do they still... Why, why do they still own that, then? Get rid of that. People's Republic of United Iberia. Oh, that is... Wild, some might say. Over here, though, organization's usually pretty good. Brauschitz, uh, army drill, offense. Oh, I like the attack. I really like that attack. But I think I might just go for air experience gain. Uh, air superiority, we're not... Um, reinstated the the Nazi leadership, huh? Um, um, organization helps, but 10%. You know, I'm going to go with 10%. I want, I want more attack, even though I'm going to be mostly on defense for quite a while. UK dominates Dutch trade negotiations. The British have expanded their influence over the Netherlands to this point where the Dutch government has felt forced to favor them in the current trade negotiations. Well, we didn't, we couldn't do anything because they're not fascist. Uh, all right then, whatever. Just go and get all these guys. If you'd like to read about them, go right ahead. 
and promote Goskurth. Goskurt. And oh, I guess, huh? So we had to wait to do to get the Kaiser, and now we can't get Mackinson. That sucks. Whatever. It is what it is. Uh, what are we doing? Building stuff up. More civilian factories. That'd be nice. Naval rearmament is quite exquisite as well. Oh, the Anglo-German friendship. Our relations were not always tense. Our monarchs share history and blood. We were friends and foes over the years. In this time of danger, we must and need to unite against our enemies. Together, we shall rule land and sea. Oh, yes, please. The allies. Wow, that's a big old common turn. That's all right, though. Maybe they'll join us. Oh, and the Chinese unit. Oh, here, what am I doing here? Can I send volunteers to China? Oh, that sucks. I can't. Oh, why? Why? I still have not played as Communist China in base game. Don't know if I ever really will, though. Mm, we've got a lot of stuff. Let's go keep at least one on military factories at all times. At least for now. And Anglo-French or Anglo-German treaty. The giant has awakened. Would be kind of nice. All right. Someone recommended that as a comment from yesterday, I don't bring up social justice again. I'll bring up that magazine again, probably, but we'll see. Ooh, we probably don't have good good organization if it's like that. Standardization. Oh, we might want to do this. Around the... Ooh. Secret Service. Luftwaffe. Fighter production cost goes down. Ooh, that's, that's pretty good. I like that. Fighter focus and close air support. That's not bad. I like that a lot. Flying Panzers. I used to use heavy fighters a whole lot more, but I, I really don't use them anymore. So, restructure the armed forces. Now that the countries are administered as one, we have the problem to have repetitive military branches with very different structures and goals. It will take some effort to make them effective and restructure them. At least we can tap into a very diverse pool of knowledge, hopefully improving the outcome significantly. So, other comments. Someone recommends an overall blues I play as the NCR. I probably really should play as the NCR again. It's been a while since I've actually played as them. Uh, excavation is done, which is nice. Uh, but yeah, with, regarding the NCR, I do have a... I probably will play them again just because we can. Sometime. I'm not sure when, but sometime. Before the update. Dive bombing, you might as well start doing that. Uh, 1939. Fuel. Absolutely gotta get more fuel. Next up, so play in TNO. Omsk. Yes. Actually, at the time of this recording, Omsk is very, very high on my list to play next for TNO. So, it'll happen eventually. Promise me. I'll promise you that. But, just, it's, it'll come. I promise it'll come. Uh, the Penne incident, not bad. Yeah, we definitely need more artillery pieces here. The light tanks are not looking too bad either. I did say I want to use light tanks. I might use heavy tanks or... No, no. I don't like these heavy tanks. No, screw it. We're going to make these guys... We have so many extra light tanks in reserve. I'm going to make these 15 combat widths because we can. Screw it. We're going to do it. Nope, that's probably the wrong one to use. There you go. Nice. Ah, uh, my tankies. They're going to be so strong. Well, maybe not so strong, but that's all right. Now we're out of a lot of light tanks. God dang it. That's all right. And what do we research? Was it this stuff? Maybe. Uh, still slightly two at a time. Rubber. And grab some rubber processing as well. All right, other comments. Use puppet manpower. Release your African colonies. I don't think I have any African colonies, do I? I mean... Croatia, Italian Union return territory. No. We have no African territories. Uh, but I, I can't get over how thick Bulgaria is. I love this. I love how big Bulgaria is. I'm not even Bulgarian, but that's awesome. I love how big Hungary is, too. Oh, it's so beautiful, man. It's just... Mmm. Mmm. But just in case, let's go get Bundes here. With the federalization of the Confederation, we are left with many different organized divisions. We must organize them, or reorganize them, in order to form a new homogeneous Bundes here. The first here was a patrick of the members of the first Bund. The four major contributors back then were Prussia, Austria, Bavaria, and Saxony. This time, there will be one central force, because right now we've got an unorganized Bund staff, which hurts us quite a bit, especially in the organization department, which really is garbage. Uh, yeah, let's see. Like I said earlier, there was a comment saying, Recruit Victoria Luis. We have, and we'll use her later on. Don't mention social justice again. I probably will eventually. Also, it's our Lorraine or War. France presented us an ultimatum today. Either return the, these, their claims or they'll take them by force. Give it back? Why would we give that stuff back, son? Go home. Go home. Everyone prepare for war. We're going to need that fuel. And let's get our division going here. Alright, and you guys, actually, you guys probably should stop training, that'd be good. And you guys all have this people, you boom, boom, you go one, one. This is not going to be good. And, ooh, 
there is the other front as well. And they have no planes too, so... Oh, I hope these guys hold out. I hope they can. I really hope they can. If not, I can shift the army around a little bit more. If possible, we might just be able to take out the French quickly. Maybe not. Maybe, maybe not. I don't know. This is a, this is a I mean, we're fighting Spain, France, Italy, and the Soviet Union, which is it's kind of a lot. Just before we have to answer them, let's go ahead and just like buy much more fuel for now. Like I'm going to spend all my civvies right now. Oh, we don't have enough convoys for this. Oh crud! Spend all the civvies. We're going to get as much fuel as we possibly can first. Before we sell, tell them no. Oh, and for the love of God, please stop training. Please stop training. Now, the, the war against Italy is not going to be easy, but still. Like, uh, we're not looking too bad. We are defending in mountains, but the board is pretty weak. Mm, my tanks might be able to bust through Italy out of, or France. If I, oh, let's go and do that. About the UK, come on. They join the vanguard. If you'd like to do this, go right ahead. Together we shall withstand anything. So now they're in us. Well, that sounds really weird. They're with us. But now we've added them in, and now they're going to take out Vietnam or Southeast Asia. Not bad. Okay, so it's not too bad then. So basically, UK and us and our other allies, which I hope to God Bulgaria is nice and strong. Please tell them that you've been working out Bulgaria. Not bad. Not good. What the heck? Not good. Eh. That's the sound I make when I'm like, oh my goodness. Oh god, no. Brandenburg. Screw it, I'm deploying these guys now. You gotta get to the line. There you go. And that that actually worked it worked stuff out pretty nicely. So I'm gonna cut you way down now. There you go. And you actually end up going right there. Alright, so a lot of these guys are inexperienced. That's fine. Give them a few days to try to get to the line. Bolster the line. Three, two, one. No. Well, actually, they have a lot of soldiers there, too. They declare war on us. Fans follow through with their threats and declare war on us. Given our mutual position and alliances, this war will be devastating for everyone involved. Now, if I... Gott steht uns bei. God stands by us. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Well, as long as I don't click that button, we're not going to go to war, so... Let's hold on to our butts. We are out of light tanks, but other than that, we're looking not too bad, actually. We should always keep a nice little reserve of infantry equipment, but let's keep it down to five, maybe for now, and improve that, maybe? Maybe not a bad idea. Ooh. There you go. And we still got to make some carriers, which we are. Actually, do we make any carriers yet? France goes war. No, we haven't made any carriers yet. That sucks. Six, seven, you know, days left. Uh, what else? Someone recommends in Kaiserreich, I should play as a Union of Britain go totalist, or play as a Bharatiya commune go totalist, or get Gandhi. I don't know if Gandhi's totalist or not, but... Turkey delivers an investment portfolio. Representatives from Turkey have visited our country and met with many of our politicians in hopes of garnering endorsements for their investment scheme. The government of Turkey would like for us to use our resources to better their own industrial capabilities and output. Turkish officials have inferred that by assisting their nation, we might be able to expect aid of their own in the future in the form of a military alliance between our nations. Um... Sure. And someone did say, within the... or ask, in the Maginot Line area... Is there an airport? Yes. It looks like within the Maginot Line, this doesn't have forts, this one, this specific tile, but there is an air, air base there, so. Alright, they're not attacking yet, which is good. We've got to wait a little bit, because they will be attacking. Oh, God. Don't want to lose my convoys. Thank you. And what else we got around here? It's not bad. We could use one more now. Any more fuel from anybody? Bulga oh, yeah. Germany under attack. Actually, not long ago, Germany found herself dragged into another war while everyone had hoped for a long-lasting peace in Europe. It's clear that tensions of the continent are still too great. German officials state that they can no longer afford to keep the Rhineland demilitarized, arguing that they need full mobility within their own borders in order to defend themselves. The German people will prevail. Oh, can't you treat the... Oh, that sucks. Oh, well. Alright, so... Now what? Can we actually win here? Oh, you guys are not in the war. Mongolia, uh... Would y'all like to come into the war? There you go. Hopefully with the, the the fleet here, they'll do okay. With the uh, the British fleet, I mean. The British fleet. 
All right, now what's going on? We gotta keep an eye on things, probably. Ooh, they're throwing in soldiers. Sweden's. Oh boy, yeah, they're over there too. Uh, Boone is here. That's. I'm glad we got that done now. Oof, standardization might not be bad. Uh, let's see. More recovery rate. Planning speed goes up. We have to strike. Uh, since we're at war, I'm gonna go ahead and start trying to make our army better. We can't train competent new troops before we've agreed on how we want to equip and train them, of course. Oh crap, who's attacking down here like that? Oh, we're defending. Oh, you guys actually did okay. Alright. Well, you know, alright. Whatever. Denmark? Oh, the mighty... Oh, good god. Oh, please don't tell me you're gonna be losing this. What is going on? We don't have enough soldiers to help push. I'm sorry, but there's n there's nowhere near enough soldiers that we 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 want we have. Just defend for the love of God. <laughs> and also, let's go ahead and go to ooh, total mobilization. Might not be bad. Uh, that would kill off all of the manpower that we have, though. Mm, I think I'll just stick to war economy. Produce, 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 produce. So. And more, 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 more stuff, please. Actually, realistically, we should probably make a lot more guns. I'll put you at the bottom of the list. Just because 40 combat widths are always nice to make and have. Alright, so. We won that battle, which is nice. My goal is maybe get down all the way to Sedan. Sedan? Sedan? I don't know, something like that. Or just go to Lille and take out Dunkirk. There you go. Uh, the Italians are attacking us, which I thought would happen. Guys, please stop attacking. For the love of God, please stop attacking. Uh, put you on high as well. Not bad so far. Uh, let's get our navy in there, even though we're losing some shippies. It's all right. I want you guys to do this, this, just for now. Actually, no. Maybe you guys actually stay over here. There you go. There you go. You can start sinking some stuff. Maybe. Hopefully. For love of God, please. Oh, maybe actually. Oh yeah, we're sinking some uh, Soviet subbies. That's nice. Uh, let's ask uh, we just go in anyways and then boom 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 and then boom 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 there you go now tankies they're gonna do the best you can you can't fail us now there's I know there's seven five, well there was seven divisions now there's five divisions in there all right doesn't look like they're really attacking too harshly which I'm totally okay with oh nice not bad see I didn't want to be the aggressor Germany is never the aggressor if they are then that's fake news <laughs> Absolute fake news. Go ahead and help them out. Go ahead and help them out some more. Monstein, good luck. You're gonna need that force that attack. Oh goodness gracious! I forgot about the speeches. Oh my goodness! I I apologize for this. This is completely my fault. Uh, I should have never spot the speeches back. <laughs> oh my goodness. It's so muffled. Can't believe I paid for this too. You know what? I think I'm going to see if I can do anything about this right now. Well, everyone, my apologies about that. Uh, there's a lot of garbled noise in the background with all them allied speeches, which I, I don't know why I bought that. It was on sale. I'm like, you know what? Maybe it would be worth it. No. 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 I don't know. It was on sale, and I was... Almost every like Steam cell, was like, okay, I always look at what DLC do I have? Okay, and what DLC do I not have? Is it worth it? Eh, probably not, but I still do it anyways just because it makes you feel good about getting something new probably. But regardless, that's just my own problem. I guess I have a DLC problem. Then again, I don't buy a lot of other games, so. Oh, hello! You guys, uh, when I reload the game, that's actually kind of scary. Oh, that is actually very scary. Go on, do that. Oh, man, they are really attacking us here. You know, I'm kind of okay with that, as long as they don't break the line. They're attacking us here, too, which has that has me worried about this one just a little bit. Yeah, it definitely has me worried about what the heck's going on up here. Um, that's not good. I mean, casualties, 14,000 versus a quarter of a million. Not bad, but... Mm -hmm. Alright, so at this point, oh, we got some oil processing, which will help us out. It is almost 1940, so let's grab some more research speed. Honestly, like, this isn't too bad so far. It's really not that bad. I'm going to go and duplicate this, and we'll just go ahead and make them 40s, just because 40s are pretty always awesome. 40s are usually the easy way out of doing, okay. One, two, 
What comes after two? Four, but usually three goes in between them. And we still have other comments to go through as well. Because there was quite a few comments from the last video. Nice, that's already 40 combat worth. Wow. And since we got 36 army XP, we'll grab some of that. That's pretty necessary. Uh, you know what? We're going to make a lot of light tanks anyway, so you might as well. And do we have anti air? Am I, am I making anti air? I'm going to, I've grown to use a little bit more anti air from time to time. And I'll actually make this division 40s. So, because they need it. So, nice. Not bad. Not bad. Cool. Uh, let's see. As we're doing this, other comments? Yeah, I should have taken more land, as someone said in the last, like, the last video. I should have taken more Polish held territories as Italian land as well. That honestly probably would have been better for us, but as my fault, I might, I might play this game again, this type of campaign, and do the boon again, just because there's a lot of people, while they want me to go with Kaiser route, which we did, in the future, if I play this mod again, specifically playing as, you know, Germany, the Gross Deutsche Bund, Please remind me to go Cancellor and Free Suffrage and Reforms. But also do Pressure Yugoslavia. So, please, if I do this mod again, and specifically Germany, let me know that I need to do these certain you know decisions and steps. Uh, this, is, this is actually getting me a little worried too, so I'm going to convert you guys already. So, there you go. We should hold hold well there, but mm, you never know. Alright, there's stack. Oh, we actually ma did make the encirclement. Nice. Good job, guys. Good job. Is there in the tanks? They're not the best tanks, but hey, they'll work. Oh, we are slowly losing here, but they're throwing in a few more divisions, so it shouldn't be too bad. Fuel refining, good. Even better fuel gain. Let's grab some planes. Better fighters, that'd be nice. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Alright, so I still want to cut these guys off really badly. Oh, that is not good over there. Um, it's looking alright. A lot of... Ooh. Oh no, sir. Tank arenas. Actually, how's Finland doing? Um, I hope they're not in the war. I don't think they are, but let's hope that they're not. So you guys are doing did pretty darn well. But I'm going to concentrate you right here so we can keep doing that. Amian. Is that Amian? That's how you pronounce it, I think. Let's see. Someone recommends we try out at the bottom of this here focus tree that we should go with. Pursue the European dream. Dawn of a United Europe. I think that's the way the person wanted me to go. European democratizer. Natural borders of Germany. Ooh, I think someone wants me to do this, but we didn't really go with this route. I think for us, it makes a little bit more sense to go with the natural borders of Germany. Just because, um, well, we already restored the Kaiser, so. Yeah, I mean, I like I said, if I play this mod again, I will go with, like, full democracy. Pursue the European dream, so. Uh, I already addressed the airport issue with the Maginot Line. Build naval ports to start building a bigger navy. Uh, so I already said that earlier, but yeah, that's what we were basically doing. Did they actually push us out? Oh my goodness, they took a piece of Belgian territory, which is supposed to be ours. Oh my goodness. That's not good. But yeah, uh, we did take those focuses, obviously, so. Not bad, not bad. Go ahead and start moving on in. We should do more than fine here, hopefully. Oh, we actually won pretty easily, actually. Uh, how's this looking over here? Did they break through? They almost did. They're almost doing it. Um, are they... Ooh. Did these guys break in? No, no, they we're still losing here. Well, that ain't good. We've lost about 40,000. Oh, boy. Oh, oh, boy. Encircle and destroy. Thank you very much. And another comment from the last video says, Someone or hopes that more mods like this one are made for other nations. Probably for like the Polish Lithuanian Commonwealth. Maybe for, um, you know, like France even. So, yeah, I think a mod like this would be pretty cool for other nations as well. So, Because what the mod designer already has for this is pretty nice, I'd say. Go, please don't go in there. Please, just get defeated. I'm not going to bother with this. I really don't want to be bothered with this part of the line. I'll be honest, so. Just hold here. My goal is to take out France first, so. And at 40, let's grab some more defense. That'd be nice. Oh, we have a focus to do as well. Modernize the Bundes staff. The military leaders from our nations must be reforged into a new staff. We must unify our ranks and agree on new tactics. This revitalization should make a very effective force. Aw, oh, yeah. And even though I kind of let time go on, I forgot to do that. We still got some extra political power out of it, so that's not too bad. 
Not too bad. They don't like my light tanks for some reason. Why don't you like my light tanks? What's wrong with you? Oh, don't lose Leo. Don't lose Leo. Come on, son. How dare you? You want to attack? Okay, we'll attack you too. We'll attack you right back, you son of a gun. No, 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 no. Actually, that's still okay since we're holding here pretty effectively. Um, if that's the case, I'm going to convert you over too. Alright, at this point, we gotta do this. I'm gonna do... Where are you guys at? Oh, they're actually breaking through quite a bit. Alright, go high. There you go. You two... You, ooh, where did you deploy? Is that you? You two? I need you guys, like, right here, right now. Just go into the line. And kind of hold. Alright, so... Can France really keep this up? They've lost 400,000 people. That's a lot of guys. Yeah, I guess they can. A lot of the divisions for them, so... What do you expect? Hmm. Hmm. I mean, this is a lot of enemies here. So many enemies. Are we missing anything else besides light tanks? Not too much. Mr. Alex are trying to hold it for the most part. Dive bombing is not bad to grab. It's 1940. Let's grab even some more ground support. That'd be good. This is not good, especially if they can go straight to Zurich. This is really not good. Actually, at this point, I'm going to have all you guys just reform the line. It's looking a little weak, so we just got to do it like this. Did you guys actually need... What the heck, guys? Wow. That was something I was not expecting. Make This makes our line a little weaker, which I'm actually a little okay with. So maybe the AI is a little more uh, okay with it, you know, trying to attack me. Um, hmm, maybe deep would be better. Hmm. Because this line just can't hold. Over here, we might be able to hold, especially if I throw in the soldiers that are guarding Italy for now over here. So, that actually might be okay. We'll see, though. We'll definitely see. No guarantee. Alright, so here we are. Let's go in. Monstein, hope you're doing well. Hope you learn a lot. You're becoming a ranger, which is a pretty good thing probably for you. We've killed over a half a million Frenchies. But that ain't going to be enough, obviously. Oh, what do you guys got? Infantry expert. It's not bad. Just keep defending for now, though, son. You're doing a good job. Ambusher. Let's go with Ambusher. That could be really good in defense, then. Yeah, they're slowly beating us up through there. Yeah, fighting on three fronts. Not good. Not really good. Not gonna lie. Not bad. Not bad. Alright. And, well, let's see. I technically did want to punch hole even further down, so... Go, Mountstein, go, go, go. These are supposed to be you know, 40 combo with light tanks. Oh, you actually did it, huh? Nice. You're getting attacked on all sides. That's pretty normal, though. Oh, for the love of God, do not get encircled here. But that makes it so that they attack, 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 attack quite a bit. Go and hang out. There's other ways to go around. There's other ways. Mm, we're still doing relatively okay here-ish. Preemptive strike is not able to be done around the Stalin line. I think we'll be okay. So, up next, uh, Von C Conference. I do want this, uh, the Jewish question, which if you didn't know anything about what we were talking about, we're playing as Germany right now, would not be very good, but that's the research slot. Our industrial expansion and other recent advance might, advances might allow us to conduct more R&D in parallel. Why not? Uh, you actually might be able to do well here, then. Wow. Not looking bad right here, though. Yeah, I really don't like fighting two front wars, to be honest. I'll be straight honest with everyone. Not a big fan of two front wars. My goal is to poke even further down to, into here. Oh, that's not good. Mm, I don't think there's much I could do about this. Uh, you do this, actually. Um, there you go. Even if they push in, it'll still be okay. 
Because my goodness, they are attacking like crazy. Three quarters of a million people have died so far in this. If possible, we're going to go straight there. We're going to circle all these soldiers. If we can. Wait, no, I said only one of you guys would do that. No, keep going, keep going. Don't you dare stop. Because if they take Lutzelberg, it won't matter. Hold, and then immediately, well, whatever divisions we have left here, begin assaulting. There we go, that's nice. I guess I'll clean up with some of the some of the stain over here. That French stain. Ah, I don't understand that. Anything else? No? Okay. Urban Assault's expert, though. That's not bad. Yeah, I mean, I don't really, as you can tell, I don't really care about this one too much. At this point, go and convert all of them to 40 combat width. Oh, we still got another sub. Nice. Well, that is how many divisions? 20. 20. Four divisions entrapped. Not bad. I do say so myself. Uh, we're going to need you to come over here as well. Uh, maybe you don't attack there. Maybe you will attack actually here. There you go. Put the pressure on them. I know it's a lot of boys to take out, but you know what? They asked for it. Any extra divisions? Divisions? Ambusher? Because you can. <clears throat> oh, nice. You actually got through here. Nice. Very good. Uh, Western Balkans is getting navally invaded. Well, that ain't good. As you can tell, I kind of stopped paying attention to the southern front as well. It is what it is. Ah, good. Oh, they're actually invading down there. Okay, so Bulgaria. Oh my goodness, that'd be so bad. So we gotta really. Oh, come on, come on, come on. We gotta finish this up. We gotta finish this up now. Come on, it's only eight divisions there. We're running out of fuel, too. Actually, you know what? I'll, I'll send my tanks down there real quick. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Finish them up, finish them up. How? There's only three divisions left. There you go. They're going to need some help down here, so race the tanks down there. that will be good while we're still suffering attacks all over the place. Oh, what are we not getting enough of? Oh, I can actually have plenty enough of this. Nice. Fuel, oh, Bulgaria. Not bad. Not bad. Keep building some more stuffs. Oh, actually, we need way more guns now. That's not good. There you go. They're on way more guns. Yeah, they love attacking our lines for some reason. Oh, wait, what? Ugh, Netherlands. Netherlands, what are you doing, son? Yeah, they're still attacking like a bunch of crazies. Then again, what do you expect? Go, tanks, go, 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 go. Mechanized offensive is nice. Let's grab some Kampfgruppe. Oh, very good. Oh, did they actually push into here? No, they did not. War bonds actually would not be bad right now. What else do we have? Anything else? Invest in Turkish state? Oh, that's not good for us. You can bind them to our own interests. Oh, I don't really want to do that right now. I'll be honest, I don't really care about it. Logistics, recovery rate, interception. Oh, alright. Well, let's do some interception then. Check this out. A little bit, right? We do have green air. That's pretty nice. They don't really have that many planes now, do they? Huh? Say maybe down here. No, they will never have this. Kill them all off right now. Enrici, go with that one. Oh, well, we have no command power, so. You guys should be done very soon, actually. We just had to send some emergency tanks down to Bulgaria. Jesus Christ, guys. We could have gotten Paris by now, but nope. You just had to have an emergency. 
we're gonna sit down deep and kill it off. Oh, we already got rid of a, a million Soviets and 1.4 basically uh, Frenchies. Oh, that actually pushes that there, huh? Uh, I wish we had more command power, but whatever. It is what it is. Yeah, they're really just killing themselves on the line. You don't get me wrong, I like it and all, but still. Not bad. How are the Italians doing, actually? I don't have that many divisions there. Hmm. Limited conscription. Extensive conscription. Oh, God, come on. Bulgaria. Don't disappoint me, Netherlands. Do not disappoint us. Yeah, they're, are they lacking guns? They gotta be lacking guns now. How's this front looking? I completely ignore the, probably the biggest front that we have. Because, yeah, this is a big front. Hello. Salu. Well, I guess just the Brits wanted to invade, huh? Alright. God dang it. Oh, actually, it's not you guys this time. It's finally not you guys. Is it? Surprised we're actually able to hold here for the most part, huh? Noosh. Meh. Good luck. You're gonna need it. There you go. Seriously, is that not the only thing? Okay, Dutch. Okay, I'm done with you guys. I, I don't I don't want to buy anything else from you, please. Iran is now my best buddy. Me and the Iranians. Oh no, that sounds like a like a band. Hmm. Hmm. Alright, head on him. We're always out of tanks, but I don't really care. Cool. Go, my tanky boys. Go, 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 go. The English sneak attack. Oh. Ah, oh, good. That's good, actually, for us. Let's grab some of this, too. Some more soft attack. That'd be nice. They knew what we were planning this entire time. Just let one guy do this. I need you to help support the attack. There you go. That should be more than enough to do this. Northern Sweden, huh? That's not good. Come on, come on, come on. Crack them. Hey, we got the extra research slot, though. That's nice. Coal localization. Germany's looking, lacking in oil, and so we must redouble our efforts in the field of synthetic oils. Six research slots. Never enough. It is 1940, of course. Eh, let's get some carry out of I mean, seriously, it feels like they just, like, didn't care, like, that they're letting these guys invade them, so. I mean, they're slowly pushing against the poles, so. Come on, guys. Seriously, they, they just, like, eh. Actually, just go there. There's only one division we can encircle, but whatever. Yeah, we probably need a lot more guns, don't we? Yeah, we need a lot more guns. Holy cow. No! Oh. Alright. At some point, we just gotta call off the attack. Just hold. That's so disappointing. Go. 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 There we go. We got it eventually. So, carry fighters, not bad. And we'll call over you. Not bad. Not great, but not bad. Alright, light tanks. I'm gonna need you over here, too. Immediately enter the battle, please. Thank you very much. Come on, man. Come on. There you go. They were instantly defeated, and we're going to go right back in and kill you off. 
Go right there immediately. No, no peace, no peace, no peace, no peace, no peace, no peace. Force them out of Paris. Do not let them in. Do not let them do anything. Kill them all off. You know, I'm, I'm, I'm just about ready to do a general attack, but it'd be probably pretty disastrous if we did that. Infantry attack. Yes. Paris has fallen. Help kill them off right here. Nice. Direct ground support is good. I'm going to wait a little bit longer. Let's grab some of this for better ship stuff. We lost an allied convoy, our own convoy. Wasn't really paying attention too much. Alright, so. Anyone else getting alien baited? Sort of. That's oh, fine, whatever. I lost Paris. Hmm. Hmm. I've got an idea. One, two, three. Let's we'll encircle the soldiers and Nancy. Yeah, seriously, I don't know why they're not doing too much down here against them, so. Uh, gun wise, yeah, we need way more guns. And close air support, too, but guns first. Uh, war bonds, war bonds it is. Wait, wait, come on. War bonds. Commando training. Radio interception group. Go, 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 go. And here we go. Come on, gods, why'd you stop attacking? This is looking very weird here. Very strange. Good, 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 good. Oh. Maybe we'll need some more, uh... Infantry, then. Or fuel, really. Bulgaria. I do not want to buy it from Bulgaria, but there's no one else to choose from. Yeah, that, at least that's looking better. I suppose we can buy some from America. Oh, actually, let's buy from these guys. Is that not enough? There we go. That's looking better. It's looking better already. Force it. Getting attacked in the Western Balkans. Come on, guys, seriously. How have you not won yet? Do we not have air spirit? No, we don't. Oh my gosh, they threw in so many planes down over here. Wowzers. Some might say Wowzers and Bowsers, but still, holy cow. Alright, they're abandoning parts of the line at this point, so. Move in. Help them out, help them out. For the love of God, Bulgaria, stop it. Either you have fuel or you don't. Alright, we got that. That's nice. Alright, let's do this. Nice. Got the next one. Uh, I can do that. Why not? Very good. And we'll grab what else? Some more artillery? Not bad idea. Did we actually not? Were, were we not able to get that? Are you serious? Oh, this is over a river. Oh, that sucks. It doesn't look like a river. How's that over a river? Hmm. Hmm. Well, is this a mountain? That would be sucked to fight into. Come on. I even force the attack. Come on, just die. Okay, at this point I'm attacking oh on this side. I'm attacking on this side. It says we can win. Can we actually win here? No, a lot of the time we won't be able to. You lied to me. Now you have so much dead German blood on your hands. Holy cow. 
All right, so synthetic rubber. Eh, let's go do that too. Large scale motorization aviation requires large amounts of rubber, which we owe no sources. We must improve the way we create it synthetically. So I'm actually okay with that. Let's grab some of the. Oh, uh, grab some of this. Why not? Because we are making some carriers. Hopefully, yeah, there we go. Not bad. We've lost that many. They've lost over 3.6 million. I'm completely ignoring the Soviets. My god. I would not have attacked here if I realized that this was like, like th going to be like this. It's ridiculous. Soviets have kind of stopped their attacks though. So finally, that was not worth it. That was absolutely 100% not worth doing. That type of attack. You're going to stay here though. You're going to go right in there. Where are you going to help attack right now? Come on, Monstein. you got to learn more. Good. Oh, come on. We just had it. We just had it, man. There you go. That's what we wanted. It's not that many divisions, too, that are going into here, too, so. Oh, another uh, guy, girl, whoever. Oh, there's Christiana. Oh, look at that. That's nice. Grab some of this as well. Very good. Mm -hmm. Not bad. And grab some more hangar space. God dang it. That's too expensive. God dang it. We need more naval XP, then. Which really, really sucks. If that's the case, go ahead, do this. Change it up to that. There we go. Oh, we actually do have a cure. Nice. Good. Kill them off. Kill every single one of them off. Very good. Finally. Alright, after this... I'm going to break up and break into here. I think that's probably a good idea. One, two, three. Not bad. Circle and destroy. You guys are looking a little thicker now, which is nice. Well, I mean, we'll deal with the Soviets in the next episode, because I think that just makes more sense to do it then. Alright, oh, actually, we could probably do, take this guy out pretty nicely as well. Maybe... Maybe... Maybe not... Yes? No? Hmm. We're going to raise conscription levels, because we can. Just in case, be careful about that. Nice. Not bad. Just force it. These guys can move pretty darn quick when unimpeded. That's actually really nice. And there they go. Wow. Trotsky survives an assassination attempt. Not bad. Good job, Trotsker. Trotsky daddy. Not bad. And there they go. Pretty good so far. Not too shabby. Uh, we're still dealing with that down there. I'm going to break up into the English territory as well. So, what do we want? What do we want? We want to win. That's what we want. Boom, boom. Still any more guns, though. Never enough factories, too. But, hey, better equipment's always welcome, right? Always better equipment. Eh, you grab that, why not? With six research slots, I'm feeling pretty, pretty relaxed about this. Can they pierce us? No, they actually can't, huh? Come on, they're constantly throwing more guys into here. Ooh, another operative. Vladimir! Vladimir is. And better artillery, great. Let's grab some better anti-air, because that'll help out with our shippies. Oh, there we go. Alright then, so then we shall do this. One, two, three. These guys are all in circle, so it's three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen more divisions encircled. Not bad. 
Now, uh, the British invaded Brittany, because, you know, that, why not? Other than that... That, guys, that's a wrong direction. That's literally the wrong direction to go. You tell them, you put a front line down. You tell them to go a certain direction, and they go the opposite direction. Thank you, guys. Thank you so much. I'm going with Modern Blitzkrieg for even more organization for infantry, which helps them stay in battle for longer, which is nice. Good. Sink those pieces of garbage. Ah, uh, yes. That's good stuff. Cruise hole? Cruiser hole? Yes. And there we go. Now that's nice stuff. You're out. You're in. Goodbye. Ah, uh, you already started production. That's fine. Doesn't matter too much. There you go. Pretty good. <coughs> as you can see there, well, as I was sneezing, they did last stand there. So that's actually kind of impressive that they're like, you know what? They're actually a little smart by doing that. Nice. They were actually a little smart. All right, so we're going to do the same thing right here, and go straight to Dijon. Taking out France took a lot. It's taking a lot longer than I thought it would, but whatever. I mean, they have the French and the Italians, and the Spanish all on the, this front. So, what do you expect? Two or three thousand guns missing. They're not attacking. Are they? Hmm. We have plenty of support equipment. But is there anything else we throw on here? Like, oh, that would kill. Yeah, that would kill all the cars that we have. What if we did motorized instead? That would kill that too. Hmm. Hmm. Carrier operations aren't bad. No, we'll do that one too, because why not? Alright, let's go on in. Oh, wait, hold on. Let's go down here, and then we'll do that. And then I'll let you go there. There you go. Send so, you guys there too. Not bad. Not bad. Any F guys here too? And there you go. Attack them in the rear. Butt attacks sometimes can work quite well. 77. He's not even a Panzer lead. I'm yet I'm still using von Monstein. Oh. Synthetic rubber ain't too bad. Air innovations too. Uh, Rex Autobahn. I like infrastructure, but that can wait. Let's go with maybe naval effort. Let's go ahead and do. Let's do this one. Hitler's anti-Semitic propaganda has created a rift in our society and has led to a rather forced expatriation of hundreds of thousands of Jewish Germans during his reign. Lots of families were expropri expropriated. It is time for us to reconcile and make things right. With things stabilizing, we now have enough credibility to make it happen. There we go. Nice. There you go. Head on in. Help him out. Help him out. Help him out. There you go. So many dead Frenchmen. Goodbye. Not bad. Two million dead Frenchmen. And for nothing. Double agent. I like that. But I don't like this. Ah, it's actually the first time the UK's done it, so I'm not too upset at them. What the heck? No, I want my tankies. Mm-hmm. One, two, three. We can do that. Let's do it right there. Five more divisions. We'll go bye-bye. I love the speed that we got, though, with these guys. Actually, we have enough light tanks now. Nice. And here we go. One. Two. We get over the river. And that was a, kind of a problem to attack this way, but that's all right. We'll begin the attacks by doing this. So... Uh, sure. I, at this point, I guess we, get, we can invest if you would like us to, so... It's fine, I don't really care. Not bad. Alright, guys, head on in. Well, someone's gotta come over here, don't they? What the heck, guys? Navy Department, nice. Air Force Department, because we can. No, the Italians stopped attacking, which is kind of disappointing, not going to lie, but whatever. Alrighty. And... Boom. Boom. 
Actually, probably better go that way, but whatever. So, all right, let them consolidate their forces. And we, at this point, I'm just here to just kill all the French soldiers. So, force them down. Get in there. Go very quickly. And help out the attack. Which attacking over the river isn't a great thing, but whatever. Oh, we lost a convoy. That's not good. Now then, six divisions encircled. That's what we like to see. All right, not bad. Pretty nice. Hmm. <laughs> Where do I want to attack next? I mean, our armies are not looking super strong right now. Actually, for this, I'm actually going to take these last two, and you can guys go, can go to this. There you go. Now you're probably looking a little better. Uh, for these guys, period. Infantry expert. Eh. That sounds okay. Social justice. Today, heads of state and popular figures of the Jewish community have met in the Von C. Villa to order to discuss plans for reconciliation between the Jewish community and the German state. Their demands for reparations for lost property and guarantee of rights, depending on how much we are willing to give, we might also incentivize Jewish expats to return home. A simple return of stolen property will be probably anger the new owners and cause sanctions, but will cost us less. Return the property. Compensate them very generously. Just, just guarantee the rights. Very generously. Let's see. In order to do appeal expatriates, reconciled, hmm, more group of population, finance Becca, Jum Jewish relations are harmonial, compensate them. Well, compensate them might sound really good. Reconciled. Alright, cool. Einheitswerke. The nickname Unity Factories symbolizes the success of our attempts to reconcile the relations. The state sponsored factories are a result of our decision to compensate without taking away property another time. Hopefully, more will follow this example. Six more civilian factories is not bad. Oh, do we do it? Oh, nice. Good job, guys. Shang-Chi is capitulated. Actually, I'm going to put you guys over here then. Boom, boom, boom. Yeah. Take these guys out. Three more divisions. So, right now, it's just me encircling guys. Actually, I don't know. Well, we can take some Italian soil. That's not a bad idea, right? You can move a little faster, right? There you go. Mm, go this way first. Why not? Oh, it's because that's in the way. I thought you were already here, so... Alright, well, then go, go in anyways. Why not? Screw it. Let's do it. Anyone else? Sophia Schultz? Yes, please. Thank you. Thank you. Love you, my tankies. My little tankers. Let you guys move around a little bit better, and then, uh... I know there's research we gotta do, but... Go. Uh, Anti-tank, that stuff is... Eh, it's alright. Let's grab some of this, too. Not bad, not bad. Slightly some naval XP. Not much, that's alright. Alright. Arado is very good. Let's grab some of them for that. Yeah, without me having to do a sea line, it's kind of nice, actually. Hungarian bomber competition. The Hungarian Air Force is currently holding trials for a new medium bomber. According to our air attaché, our newest model is poised to win. A formal request from the Hungarian government is expected shortly. Representatives of the manufacturer strongly in favor of the sale, but there are national security concerns about selling your most modern equipment to a foreign country. Should we permit the sale to go through? Oh, uh, you betcha. They're part of our alliance, so I don't see a problem. Actually, go... Oh, yeah, both of you are already there, so just do that. There you go. Shouldn't be too bad. Yeah, those French soldiers not doing super well now. Wow, they literally couldn't even get there in time, and they were overran. Holy cow. Alright, help them out right there, then. And by help them out, kill them off. Beautiful. Yeah, they're really concentrated around here, which I don't really want to invade. Uh, Bulgaria's looking pretty nice. These guys aren't really trying to attack anymore, which is kind of disappointing, I'll be honest. I was kind of hoping that these guys would do a little bit more, but they obviously are not. Actually, at this point, uh, I don't know if we can do just a general tank attack with these guys. Let's make a few more light tanks, too. There you go. What happened over here? Convoy's nice. I just want you to just kill the enemy off. There you go. And then go right there and go right there. Something like that.
There you go. Uh, boom, boom. Well, whatever. I'm going to manually control them anyways. It's just a bunch of micro that's all it is. Oh, maybe if we take Bordeaux, actually. Oh, they're actually in circles. Nice. Good. Good job, guys. Well, there goes Bordeaux. Go right ahead. Oh, they capitulated. Nice. All right, that makes it a lot easier with them. All right, so here's what we're going to do. Uh, you guys are going to surround the Italians like you already did. You did a great job, but go to the Pyrenees. I'd rather focus on the Italians right now. And then you guys, well, you're already down here. If you can, secure as much land as you possibly can before anything else bad happens. Just go right on ahead. How many divisions do these guys have? They don't even have cores on some of this territory. Uh, that's some. Um, a few divisions here and there. We've got to deal with that, too, but I'm not too worried about that. Uh, please, just go ahead. Please, just go ahead. Take this time so we don't have to fight through the Pyrenees Mountains. Good lord, I don't want to fight through these mountain ranges. Alright, they're doing a really good job of just moving in. Nice. Go if you can. God dang it. We're going to get encircled because we're moving way too fast for this. I kind of like it, though. I'm kind of... I like the speed. Uh, they're going to leave. Go and do that. Thank you. And we shall do... It's almost 1941. Get some more output. Just go, Brando. I'm sure will use these guys a little bit more effectively. Eh, since we're here, we might as well, right? There you go. And there you go. Something like that. Alright, so we gotta get our infantry into here. Let the tanks do what they need to do. They'll be they're doing a good job regardless, so. How are we looking down here? Not bad. It's like they just abandon the line sometimes. I don't understand the AI. But you know what? I can't complain too bad too much about that, right? I mean, these guys are in circle, that's awesome. Gotta love it, right? We literally just took their port, so what do they do? They can't do anything now. Uh, I'm gonna tell you guys to stop maybe? Now I want you to like wrap around here and take these guys out immediately. Good. Taking the supply point, the, v the VP will be good, so they literally have no supply then. Question of Yugoslavia. We now stand supreme in Europe. France was, was long the foundation of stability in southeastern Europe, but now the entire area is up for grabs. We can pull all the nations there in our orbit with no one left to stop us. It's time to tell the Yugoslavians that they had to make a choice. Either they stand with us or they will be swept away. Uh, yeah, I don't care about them. Uh, they're literally already gone, so... Nice. Boom. And before we end the episode, I would like to take out Iberia and get back to Gibraltar, so. And the tanks have proven that they're pretty darn capable. We've got plenty of manpower since we did mobilize a little bit earlier, so. Go figure. And we'll deal with this once the tanks are finished with Iberia, of course. Anything else around here? Oh, an allied loss, whatever. Yeah, seriously, what's wrong with the Soviet Union? Why do they stop? It's, I'm a little disappointed that these guys just aren't as fast as the, the light tanks. And most, a lot of the armies up there, too. Oh, there goes, a, there goes Iberia! Okay, then. Fallback lines? I guess we can spill to expatriates. We should extend our engagement and offer lucrative conditions to German-Jewish expats, and especially to scientists. We should increase the research capabilities in the sphere of po sheer population potential. Let's open further opportunities, which is a good thing. Alright, well, you guys can head on up here and take out Oviedo. I probably seen that wrong, but whatever. And then you guys come on over here and uh, how about with that? All we got to take out next is Italy and the Common Turn, which we'll do the Common Turn next episode. Are you there? Oh, yeah, they already did. Nice. God, they're so fast. I love them. I remember when I played Germany Führerreich before, and I used light tanks. They're just they they won the Spanish Civil War so fast. I love it. We need more. I need more, 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 more. Pump, pump those numbers up, son. Oh, we're actually running out of things to build. Uh, 
We can build some roads. That'd be actually good for supplies. I'll, I'll do that off screen as well, so. Alright, we took a lot of the army here. Well, maybe not a lot of it, but a good chunk of it. How many men did we lose? 300,000 men? That's unfortunate. But soon enough, we'll be able to focus our entire military on the border with the common turn. This is kind of nice. I don't go, 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 go. There they go. Beautiful. Go right on ahead, and I'm going to throw you. Now, as much as I love what you've done, we had too many generals for now, so I'm going to split your army up. I'm sorry, but it has to be done. He will be back as a general later on, but for now, there you go. This is the way it's got to be. Ooh, Arado is nice. Yes, please. Yes, please. And then we'll leave one for, you know, manually just putting down resistance or putting down or doing conducting espionage things. Not bad. Are the lightnings? They're already down there. God, Monstein's doing a great, tremendous job. I love Monstein now. And again, I usually enjoy using him. I mean, look at that. They just, mmm. They just, mmm, all the time. I love it, mmm. I recommend at least one guy go there so you can take out the ports. Okay, well, there. Alright then. No problem. Now it's literally just taking out the land. Oh, there's a carrier. The British Navy's over there. Nice. Good job, guys. We're literally getting there before they can even retreat. That is ridiculously fast. What is your speed like, son? Are you winning, son? They're definitely winning. Holy bad words. Alright, well, they're gone now. Well, I guess in the next episode, we'll probably focus on the Soviet Union. But if you enjoyed this episode so far, guys, leave a like, subscribe if you're new, check out my Discord link in the description below, and I'll see you tomorrow when we will do a lot more of our focus tree and take out them commies. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.